Well fought, everyone. You bested Sigurd and me. That's quite the feat. There is much to improve upon, but this is a wonderful start. Great work. Thank you. I can't believe we had to fight against Queen Lumera. Yeah, well, I can't believe we won. Though you have only just awoken, your power seems to be growing already, Divine One. I'd like for you to have this. This is the sword you were using, isn't it? Yes. An ancient blade that can be wielded only by divine dragons. It served me well for many years, but now it is yours. Consider it a prize for your victory today. Thank you. Someday, I'll prove that I'm worthy of this sword. I have no doubt. Please, take this as well. Is this another emblem ring? No. It is purely ornamental. You see, before your slumber, I made you a promise. What was it? I said I'd give you a birthday present that suited you perfectly. I was working on it in private, but I was unable to finish it in time. That birthday has long since passed, but I would quite like to give you this gift now. I'm sorry. I can't accept. Why not? That ring fulfills a promise you made me, right? But I don't remember that promise. It'd feel wrong accepting it. Like I was taking a present meant for someone else. Please offer me this gift again once I've remembered everything. Everything, you say? <sighs> Did facing me in battle stir any recollections? It didn't. I'm sorry. You need not apologize. It doesn't matter what you can remember right now. I only hope that one day, you will think of me as your mother, as you did a thousand years ago. <laughs> Forgive me. I was so thrilled to spend time with you again. I suppose I got a little carried away, didn't I? Oh, no. It's all right. <laughs> I don't mean to put you on the spot. Perhaps we should call it a day, hmm? But let's agree to chat again in the morning. What do you say? Pinky promise? <laughs> All right. Oh, how wonderful to see my child awake at last. Now we'll never have to be apart. There is so much to catch up on, so much to see and do together. We can chat for hours, take long walks, share meals, and then... <clears throat> If my child's memories are truly lost, I wonder. <sighs> Emblem Sigurd. I am here. There's something I'd like to discuss with you. Today certainly was eventful. Queen Lumera seems so kind and caring. I'm sure she was a wonderful mother. If only I could remember those days. I must have felt so lucky to be her child. Why are you here alone? <laughs> what was that? Was that me? Are you all right? It looked as though you were having a bad dream. I was. But yes, I'm all right. Were you here this whole time? You were wearing my ring when you went to bed. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to take it off. That's all right. Keep it on. Then if something happens, I will be able to help. Besides, after a millennium together, I would feel uncomfortable if we were separated now. Marth. What was I like? Hmm... You knew me back then. You must be able to tell me something. 
Well... You were kind, as you are now. There's no need to remember everything at once. Take your time. Ease back into your memories. Lumera advised that too, didn't she? Yes, she did. Sorry. I don't mean to be impatient. It's all right. <sighs> what was that? I'm not sure. An enemy raid? We had best take a look. I'm worried about Lumera and the others. Agreed. Vander! Clan! Fram! Ah, oh, Divine One. Thank goodness you're safe. What's happening? Tell me! fought their way into the ring vault. If you ask me, they're trying to get their hands on the <sighs> emblem rings. Even as we speak, Queen Lumera is defending the vault. Quickly, we must fly to her aid. Sounds like a plan. Follow me! You called? <laughs> the divine dragon looked right at me. The divine dragon looked at me. Too many of them. We'll never make it to the Ring Vault. To the soul, right? Yes, this is the one. Then let go. I hear voices. Someone's coming. Moment too soon. The Crown Prince Alfred of Firene is here to help. Let me at him. Prince Alfred of Firene, you said? Could it be? Are you the Divine Dragon? You finally woke up? I did, yes. That's amazing! You know, I've waited ages for this to happen! There's so much to talk about. Later, of course. After we've taken care of these scoundrels. Uh, who are they, anyway? We're not sure. They attacked so suddenly. Well, let's do this quickly. Pin down whoever's in charge and get some answers. Oh, these are my retainers, Etie and Boucheron. From now on, consider us at your disposal. Lead the way, Divine One! Thank you for your help.
I am as strong as ever. What's our move? Sorry, Divine One. If I'm near an enemy you're fighting, call on me if you need some extra oomph. That was good training. It's an honor to meet you, Divine. My arrows are... With these muscles, I'll have those flyers dropping like flies. I will defend, always.
humble sacrifice. Engage! Fate has brought us here. This is it! I live to fight again. Looks like we cleared the way. Let's get to the ring vault. Whoever it is you are, the rest of your forces have all been defeated. So surrender now. If you refuse, I will stop you. <laughs> but how? Do I detect a hint of fear? Of course I do. <laughs> Time to die. Look out! over to me. Leave here at once! powers to you. I hoped it would be enough to bring you back to me someday. But now, it would seem that I am completely spent. <sighs> oh no, this is my fault. I did this. No, my dear. You have to push those thoughts away. There is nothing a mother wouldn't do 
to see life return again to her beloved child. <laughs> but I... This ring, it belongs to you now. The ring of the Holy Knight. I had so hoped to give you the ring I made as well. But that's not possible now. Listen to me, child. Those who invaded here... I sense the power of the fell dragon within them. <sighs> you must not allow them to capture any more of their rings. Please, I beg of you, gather together all twelve rings. <sighs> and when your scattered memories return to you, you must fight on with the utmost divinity. I believe in you, my child. I understand. I'll collect the rings. I swear to you. And I'll fight. I'll do whatever you want. But please, don't leave me. <sighs> Mother! Ah, <sighs> oh, young one. How I've longed to hear you call me that. All of those years. I held out hope. My heart is fuller than you could ever know. It can't end like this. You were going to give me that ring once my memories came back. You promised. And there, there are so many things you haven't told me yet. You said that we would talk. I did. There's still so much I wanted to say to you. Being your mother, Becoming your mother has brought so much happiness into my life. I know, and I'm happy to be your child. In this moment, here and now, and a thousand years ago, I am. Don't go. Stay with me until I remember again. Please, mother! I need more time! <laughs> oh, my sweet one. Now. Let's make a promise, mother and child. We'll make it a pinky promise. I swear to you, I'll be with you always and forever. And the ring, remember. Once you've rested, we will talk. You and I. Mother. No. Please! This simply cannot have happened. Queen Numera. Divine Dragon Queen. She has left us. Mother. Please wake up. You promised you'd stay by my side. You have to. You have to keep.